In a rare burst of common sense, the new head of the United Nations body that assesses the science related to climate change, warns against over-the-top rhetoric that falsely suggests the world will end if global temperatures rise above the UN's target of 1. 5 degrees Celsius. Jim Ski, chair of the UN's Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, says fearmongering about the target is counterproductive. In weekend interviews with Der Spiegel and the German news agency DPA, he called for a more balanced approach to addressing climate change. We should not despair and fall into a state of shock if global temperatures rise above the UN target, said Ski. A leading climate scientist and professor of sustainable energy at London's Imperial College. If you constantly communicate the message that we are all doomed to extinction, then that paralyzes people and prevents them from taking the necessary steps to get a grip on climate change. The world won't end if it warms by more than one. 5 degrees. Ski also said it's unrealistic to think changes can be imposed on people's lifestyles in terms of how they live and what they eat. Individual abstinence is good. But it alone will not bring about the change to the extent necessary, Ski said. If we are to live more climate consciously, we need entirely new infrastructure. People will not get on bikes if there are no cycle paths. Longer term, we probably will not be able to do without technological solutions like the underground capture of CO2. To be clear, Ski says climate change is serious. He supports using renewable energy to reduce greenhouse gas emissions from coal-fired electricity and replacing internal combustion engine cars with electric vehicles. He warned rising global temperatures, the World Meteorological Organization has declared July the hottest month in recorded history, will mean a more dangerous world, heightening societal tensions globally and leading to increasingly severe weather as now being experienced in Canada and globally. In his acceptance speech on assuming the IPCC chair, he described climate change as an existential threat to our planet, and last year warned it's now or never to limit global warming to 1. 5 degrees Celsius, a target the IPCC says will likely be exceeded within 10 years.